okay first uh, quantity which we measure is measuring mass what do we use to measure mass now the SI unit of mass is kilograms but the smaller units are grams um, larger unit is tons so sometimes the mass is given in kilograms sometimes in grams sometimes in tons but when we are doing moles we measure the mass in grams so if kilogram is given we converted it to grams Tons are given, we convert it into grams. But remember one thing, that if one quantity is given, uh, the mass of one quantity is given and you have to calculate the mass of another quantity, then you don't change the unit of mass. You can keep the tons as such. Dono side pe same quantity is being measured. Haan, agar aapne um, mass given hai and you have to calculate volume or if mass is given and you have to calculate concentration, then you have to convert the unit of mass to grams. We use moles, may we, uh, we measure the mass in grams. Okay, so which uh, apparatus we use? We have beam balance, we have electronic balance. Normally, we use electronic balances in for measuring mass. So if they ask you, okay, you have to measure the mass of this quantity, this substance, which apparatus you will use? So you'll use electronic balance because it has more accuracy and it can measure small amounts of um, mass very accurately. Okay, time. For measurement of time, we use stopwatch, either the digital stopwatch or the analog stopwatch, both can be used um, to measure intervals of time. Uh, time ke units, aapko pata hai, SI unit of time is seconds, but we have larger units of time like hour, minutes, and you know their conversions. So time ke, normally we measure time in seconds. In order to measure temperature, we use different instruments like uh, the main instrument we, we commonly use in labs are thermometers, uh, mercury thermometer or alcohol thermometer. We can also use temperature sensors and attach these to data loggers. These can requ um, record the temperature over a period of time at regular intervals. So it's very useful, very accurate. Uh, SI unit for temperature is Kelvin, uh, but um, commonly used a unit is degree Celsius and um, temperature in Kelvin is equal to temperature in degree Celsius plus 273. So remember this. Um, so most commonly used apparatus, if they ask you okay, which apparatus you will use to measure temperature, so that is thermometer. Okay, next, volume. Now, this is very important. Measurement of volume comes often in the paper, especially the ATP paper. SI unit for volume is meter cube or cubic meter. Um, um, it is equal to 1000 dm cube and 1 dm cube is equal to 1000 cubic centimeter. Uh, most commonly, we measure volume in cubic centimeter. Titration, solutions, we measure the volume in cubic centimeter. And in moles, we measure the volume a unit mostly commonly um, uh, cubic decimeter use karte um, not cubic meter that's a very big unit so uh, if volume cm cube mein given ho to we have to convert it into dm cube we can easily convert it volume in cm cube over 1000 kar den to aapka dm cube mein aa jata hai Achha, now the different apparatuses are available to measure volume of the liquids which apparatus we are going to select this is very important this depends on uh, what we are doing for example uh, burette the first apparatus as you can see here is burette this long glass tube with a tap at the lower end and its maximum capacity is from 0 to 50 cubic centimeter now so if you want to measure the volume up to 50 cubic centimeter very accurately then you use burette. Mostly burette is used in titration. Okay, titration experiments mein we always use burette. Jab aapne unknown volume mayor karne ho, jin ki range up to 50 cubic centimeter. Okay. Uh, the second apparatus shown here is measuring cylinder. Right? Now, measuring cylinder is not a very accurate method. Remember, in the question, if they have mentioned that the volume is measured with the help of a measuring cylinder, then remember it can add 
एरर टू योर एक्सपेरिमेंट एंड इफ दे आस्क यू वॉट कुड बी द पॉसिबल एरर तो वो आपकी यही एरर होगी दिस इज द मोस्ट कॉमन एरर यूज इन एक्सपेरिमेंट्स मेयरिंग सिलेंडर वॉल्यूम इज मेयर विद मेयरिंग सिलेंडर मेयरिंग सिलेंडर्स की डिफरेंट कैपेसिटीज होती हैं हंड्रेड का भी टू हंड्रेड का भी फाइव हंड्रेड क्यूबिक सेंटीमीटर का भी बट इट्स नॉट एन एक्यूरेट मैथड टू मेयर वॉल्यूम ठीक है थर्ड इज द ऑपरेटर्स नंबर थ्री इज योर पिपिट Now this is also a glass tube, a smaller glass tube. Um, pipette can only measure a fixed volume. It has only one marking. If you can see it at its upper end, so it can only measure one fixed volume. You can have pipettes of capacity five cubic centimeter, ten cubic centimeter, twenty cubic centimeter, twenty-five cubic centimeter normally up to. 25 cubic centimeter. So, unki fixed capacity hoti hai. There is only one marking. It's also a very accurate method of measuring volume, of measuring a fixed volume. Uh, if you want to measure fixed small volume like 5, 10, 20, 25, you can use uh, a suitable pipette for that. The last apparatus which is uh, is volumetric flask now volumetric flasks have different capacities and these also have only one marking means these can also also measure only a fixed volume you can have a 50 cubic centimeter measure a volumetric flask 100 250 500 depending on the capacity likha hota hai uspe now volumetric flasks are used to make solutions If you want to make a solution of 100 cubic centimeter, you want 500, 1 liter. Now, unke liye volumetric flask is an accurate method of making solution. Measuring cylinders and beakers are not accurate. Remember, titration me ye question aksar aata hai. They ask you ki solution banane ke liye ham kya apparatus use karein? 250 ka solution banana hai, 100 ka banana hai. to make solutions we use volumetric flask as shown here this is the volumetric flask now this volumetric flask is of 100 ml capacity theek hai so measuring cylinder can measure to the nearest 0.5 cubic centimeter but it's not accurate burette accurately measure up to 0.05 cubic centimeter so it's a very accurate method agar aapne unknown volume measure karna hai to uske liye burette is ideal but it can measure up to 50 cubic centimeter only pipette is ideal to measure fixed volume small fixed volume of 20 25 10 depending on the capacity of the pipette it's always written on it ke how much it can measure remember that pipette and volumetric flask cannot measure variable volumes they can only measure a fixed volume which is written on them theek hai ओके ना वॉल्यूम ऑफ गैसेस अभी तो हम वॉल्यूम ऑफ लिक्विड कर रहे थे वॉल्यूम ऑफ अ गैस मेयर करने का बेस्ट थिंग इज गैस सरेंज गैस सरेंज कैन मेयर अप टू 100 क्यूबिक सेंटीमीटर की कैपेसिटी होती है एंड इट्स अ वेरी एक्यूरेट मेथड टू मेयर गैस वॉल्यूम ऑफ द गैस नॉर्मली हम रेट ऑफ रिएक्शन के एक्सपेरिमेंट में गैस सरेंज यूज करते हैं बट दिस इज नॉट द ओनली मैथड आपने देखे होंगे अपरेटिस पास पेपर्स में समटाइम्स दे कलेक्ट द गैस अब वॉटर इन एन इन्वर्टेड मेयरिंग सिलेंडर ग्रेजुएटेड मेयरिंग सिलेंडर तो उसमें भी वॉल्यूम मेयर हो सकता है ठीक है सो उसमें भी करेक्ट हो सकती है गैस अब वॉटर अगर आप गैस को कलेक्ट कर रहे हो तो आप मेयरिंग सिलेंडर में भी कलेक्ट कर सकते हो और उसका वॉल्यूम बिकॉज इट इज ग्रेजुएटेड यू कैन नो इट्स वॉल्यूम बट द बेस्ट मैथड इज गैस सरेंज Okay, so let's uh, have a simple quiz. Uh, what apparatus would you use to measure the time taken to run 100 meter? Time ke liye the best option is stopwatch. Digital stopwatch will give us a better uh, result, a more accurate time. Exactly 25 cubic centimeter of sodium hydroxide. For fixed volumes, 25. The best option is pipette. Uh, 23.6. Now a pipette cannot measure up to in fractions. 23.6 में तो बिल्कुल नहीं कर सकती. वो fix volume करेगी 25. So इसके लिए the best option would be burette. 
Burette can give you up to uh, can you can be used to make a volume up to 50 0 to 50 cubic centimeter or wo bahut accurately isko measure kar sakte 65 cubic centimeter of carbon dioxide gas now for gas the best option is gas syringe uh, 80 grams of water what mass measure karna mass ke liye electronic balance is the best option so electronic balance so uh, so far what we have covered ke mass ka unit grams hai and we use electronic balance in chemistry to measure mass uh, time ke liye we use stopwatch uh, second uska unit hai temperature ke liye we use thermometer and degree celsius mein generally we measure in degree celsius in chemistry volume for liquids we use burette and pipette these are more accurate and volumetric flask if we want to measure uh, make solutions for gases we use a uh, gas syringe and volume is generally measured in cubic centimeter in uh, chemistry or uh, in calculations you sometimes have to convert this to dm cube 